Hello, everyone. Following on our quarter four preparation for advanced sellers five tips video, link here, we received a message to talk about the eBay's promoted listings beta pay per click feature. In this video, I'm going to show you how this feature works. First things first, what's eBay promoted listings beta pay per click feature? Introducing promoted listings advanced beta for business sellers. So eBay says here, we have now expanded our promoted listings portfolio and would like to introduce you to promoted listings advanced beta. This new campaign type gives you preferred access to the top spot in eBay search results through keyword and budget control. So what you need to know about the promoted listings advanced beta. Promoted listings advanced beta is based on cost per click model. So you pay when someone clicks your ad. It works by allowing you to target the keywords that matter to you. And you then bid for the number one slot in eBay search results. You always determine exactly how much each click is worth to you. The daily budget feature ensures that you're in full control of your ad spend. You can combine it with promoted listings standard for maximum visibility. So you can get started by following these simple steps. You can start by naming your campaign and then choose dates and a daily budget. Name your ad group and add your listings and keywords. Select the cost per click for keywords and then you're ready to review your campaign. So now let's jump into my screen and go through this feature, but don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. So, all right guys, so we all got this message about the new promoted listings, the beta advanced, and the one that we're going to talk about today is the pay-per-click advanced option. So basically what the pay-per-click campaign is, is us choosing the amount of money that we are going to pay eBay for every person that clicks our product or the campaign. Now, more advanced sellers will have this option because you could be losing money because people may be clicking on your campaign but not buying anything from you. So this is why it's for the advanced sellers because they know what to advertise and what to put the campaign on and how much money they can make off of that certain product. So let's jump into it. The first thing we're gonna do is click on create campaign. So now let's go through this page. So the first thing we need to do when creating a new campaign is naming your campaign. For this example, we'll go with Zeke PPC. And the most important thing on this page is your daily budget, which we will set at $1. So this is basically the maximum amount that you are willing to spend each day for this particular campaign. And I prefer leaving it $1 because for the advanced sellers, we know that $1 is really, really expensive when it comes to every day for a certain campaign. So just leave it at $1. Don't go above the one dollar the minimum okay and now it's time to set your date now because you are spending one dollar a day for this campaign i recommend setting a certain date and not having it go on forever not even for the advanced sellers so what i recommend is uh trying out a couple days at a time and keeping track of it and its success and then of course, after you set your dates, you can create your ad groups. So you can go ahead and add more ads in groups. And of course, now you're going to go ahead and add your listings. So here on your listings page, you're gonna get your title, the price, the quantity, of course. You're gonna get your impressions, um, top 200. Of course, the date on site and the number of sold items. So here you're going to go ahead and choose the products that you have the most profit margin from. As dropshippers, we are working with a low profit margin. So you have to pick maybe your top three items that you know will make a good profit. So for this example, let's go ahead and select a couple of these top items. Once you have those products, go ahead and click on add. 
So once you go ahead and select your products, eBay will give you the suggested keywords. Here you can see you have many, so you don't really have to add any new ones. So you can go ahead and select the exact keywords. So when you go ahead and click on that, you have those options. And of course, now you have the suggested bid for every keyword and how much it's going to cost you. And then from here, we can go ahead and launch it. So here we have the message, please take another look at the following. Here we did not add the group name. So we're just gonna go ahead and put in Zeke group. Then when we launch again, it seems like we have to take another look at uh, the daily budget. So for our daily budget, so this is the whole day, let's go ahead and put in $5 and then go ahead and launch. So that's going to equal to five clicks per day. And then here you come to your campaign overview where you can see that it's ready. That's it. Remember that this feature is live for many sellers, but not all sellers. But hey, what are your thoughts on this new feature? Leave your comments down below and thank you and I will see you next time.